Hey, this is uh, TR from T-Man Performance. It's 2014 and what we're getting ready to do is to introduce to the uh, public our new welded ports. We've already released some of these to some of our dealers and have gotten excellent feedback on uh, better torque numbers and better horsepower numbers from these heads. Uh, in 2014, uh, T-Man Performance is going to be welding all of our exhaust ports on our twin cam heads, our CVO heads, and also some of our uh, Sportster uh, heads. So it's uh, something we're very excited about and been working very hard on. What I'm going to do here is run through a, a couple of uh, heads that we have uh, welded and then run our program on and then show you the difference before and after. So what you're getting ready to look at right here is a standard CVO head that is just ones that we receive all the time. And we ran our CNC program on it. And as you can see, the CNC program is touching very little of the port. And this is what we're running into. It's getting more and more inconsistent with the core shift on the Harley casting. So what we're electing to do is to weld this port completely. And as you can see here, we're welding the whole port. We're not just putting a little a weld in the back and, and stuff like that. We can't be consistent unless we know that we're picking up everywhere on these ports. So as you can see here, we've raised the floor here of the port and also we've put enough material in the back of the port to so that when we run this program it's consistent time and time again. As you can see here, this is the same port that you've seen on the previous head. And as you can see, it's touching everywhere. It's also got our area in the back. As you can see, we've got our directional vein here, which basically starts the uh, flow of the port and everything and gets everything moving in the right direction. We also are able to go in here and repair the guide holes. The CBOs are very bad about having prosthes on each side of the guide hole, which uh, you know we're seeing a lot of hairline cracks on them. So while we're in there welding, we get all that prosody out and just uh, it works very well. So what we're doing is trying to make sure that we are giving our customers a consistent port time and time again. And in doing that, it's helped us with our port velocity, our flow numbers, and uh, everything across the board. You're going to see some videos coming from Brandon on the way that we check our port velocity. We have invested uh, uh, in new flow benches and new equipment to check all that. I think you'll be very impressed. I think it's the most accurate way that we can physically check this stuff. So we'll have all that data and everything for you also. Uh, please remember, everything will be up on Facebook and our new uh, website. Our website should be up about the 1st of February with all of our new kits. And then uh, if you have any questions, feel free to touch out uh, or reach out to us on Facebook. Brandon keeps a pretty good eye on that. And also we'll have all the data on uh, our new uh, website. So feel free to look it all over. If you have any questions, get in touch with us. Thank you very much.